Hey guys, um, Zach here. Today I just want to do a video on how to care. And sorry for that thing at the beginning. There was something on the top of the tank. But um, this is going to be how to care for and a setup video on my water dragon. Um, this is my water dragon. Godzilla, as my grandmother called him. But what you're gonna need for a setup is a large water dish. Something like this should be fine. You need water. I use spring water so you don't really have to use chemicals or anything. But don't really use tap water without a dechlorinator. Um, for bedding, I use coconut husk. It's good for retaining moisture. You're gonna need a basking bulb. Uh, this is like a 60, 70 watt, I believe. Uh, a temperature gauge for the basking area. If you want the tank to look nice, some vegetation or something, and plenty of sticks, and they like to climb, so, um, yeah, that's what you need. And now on to care. Dust their uh, crickets with calcium. Usually, it should have vitamin D in it. The tank needs to be fairly warm about uh, 70 to 95, I'd say, degrees, maybe a little more, I'm not sure, but maybe around that, but um, a good tank size would be 55 gallons, and uh, my bird is going nuts for some reason, and these guys get pretty big, so you're going to want to have them in a large tank for most of their life, at least. Because these guys do get up to three feet for females and two and a half for males. I'm pretty sure this is a male, so one second, let me try to quiet down my bird. Okay, sorry about that. Um... It's kind of quiet now, but, um, this is my water dragon setup as of now. I put some rocks in there. Um, humidity should be fairly high, not dry, but, like, subtropical, kind of, well, yeah, um, they do need humidity. And they, after all, they are called water dragons, so they need some big to lay in. But, uh, yeah, let me end the video here because my bird is going absolutely nuts. Sorry about that. And, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed, and I hope this helped you out if you're thinking of getting a water dragon. They make good pets, and, uh, yeah, thanks for watching.